Have you ever found yourself in that awkward place when inviting someone to your business, host, or even customer opportunity and they said, maybe? What do you do with that? Well, I'm Becky Speed, Direct Sales Specialist, and I'm going to give you some practical tips, advice, and exactly what to say to move that maybe to a yes. Now, keep in mind that no is not N-O, it's K-N-O-W, that they need to know more information. The key to overcoming objections lies in understanding why they're objecting or, or resistant. Objections are actually a good sign. What it means is they haven't shut you completely down. It means they're considering what you've invited them to, whether it's your hosting, your business opportunity, or even to become a client. It means they're considering it, and that's awesome. So let me share a few scenarios and suggestions with you. Be gracefully assertive in everything that you do and, and ask questions to discover why they're resistant and then come from a place of true desire to serve them by offering a solution that you have to their concern. Now, what if they really want to say yes, but they've got limited funds? What she's really saying is, please show me why I should spend my money for this. And you can do that, right? And if there's some kind of fear that seems to be manifesting, reassure them that they can recover their investment very quickly along with the value and the benefits. Benefits are huge. You know, they might be saying maybe because they're truly confused or, or they just don't understand. No one wants to appear silly or, or like they're ignorant. So it's easier to say maybe. Give them more information. Oftentimes they're listening to others or, or even the voice of doubt in their own head that they're doubting that they can even be successful. What she's really asking you to do is to notice her emotional why and then show her how to tie that to simple, practical, and tangible steps for success. Be sure not to overwhelm her, so start with first steps and then move to next first steps. One of the biggest reasons you get a maybe is from overwhelm. Most of the time they're just not good decision makers and, and if there are too many options, most people will just opt for nothing. Kind of sad, but it's true. What this person's really saying is, please give me a decision and help me make that decision that would be best for me. You know more than I do. Also provide a sense of security. Maybe responding something like this. You know, I completely understand. Most people that are in this position that you're in of exploring our business or host opportunity have had similar thoughts. And then go on to share information that dispels that perceived issue. You know, you want to respond only to their concerns and not talk about a lot of other issues. So you might want to say, you know, if I'm understanding you correctly, your question is whether this is the smart thing to do right now, right? And my all-time favorite response that has gotten me more yeses than anything else is to simply ask, what would it take? You know, speaking of that, what would it take? I'm actually in Michigan with an awesome direct sales company called Life Expressions Decor at their January Roundup National Conference. And I am loving spending time with them. We're doing some teaching, some training, some coaching. You know, would you love to have me come to your next company's event, national conference, leadership conference, or, or perhaps your own leadership retreat or the one that your leader's putting on? I'd love to chat with you more about this and we can talk about what it would take. Email me at support at beckyspeed.com. Make sure that you let me know what your favorite idea was from today's video and also what you do to move that maybe to a yes. I want to hear from you. I'll be in your inbox next week. And oh, don't forget, on every Monday morning at 8.30 Central Time, I have a, a Bible study. You can find it on my Facebook page, The Christian Direct Seller. I also have another business page on Facebook called um, Direct Sales Specialist. And if you're just watching this video and you want to get videos just like this with great training tips for your direct selling business each and every Saturday delivered right to your inbox, all you have to do is go to BeckySpeeth.com. B-E-C-K-Y-S-P-I-E-T-H. Can't wait to be with you next week. Bye, everybody.